Good morning everybody. Welcome to another daily YouTube video. I hope you're well. I hope you've had good rest. If you're watching this uh, whenever, I don't know, I've just woken up. Uh, it is like 8, 8.46, there we go. It's quarter to nine. We're gonna grab some coffee and get on with editing yesterday's vlog. I need to, uh, look, look, I take, I take, I take each day right now as it comes. Take it day by day. Edit this morning, do some things like put the bins out, because it's black bin day. And look, okay, so I've got some cool, I have got some cool things to show you as well. These just came in the post this morning, real super early, uh, which is pretty much why I'm up right now. But these came in the post, this right here, these little fittings what I have been searching for. So this is for the Mini, some of the stuff that I've been struggling with uh, on the car. These are the correct, the correct fittings, as you will be able to see when I untwist this really cautiously with one hand. So there you go. So this is a uh, compression fitting. I don't know if you watched when I was trying to put these things together but I was missing these because I was using the wrong fittings. So now I'm using the correct fittings and it's all gonna work. We're nearly there. We're nearly there, at least with the brakes. So at some point we'll get out in the garage, maybe not today, just because I wanna wait for the other bunch before I do that. At some point, we'll get out there and we'll finish those brakes, we'll get those lines hooked up, which would be awesome. Without further ado, let's flip and make some coffee. Again, yesterday's vlog is edited and going live to YouTube. Well, it's not going live to YouTube. Uh, it's going, uploading to YouTube right now. Look at it go. It's doing its thing. I'm so happy. I'm really, really excited. Again, it's a cool video. I really hope you guys enjoy it. Uh, it was just my day, but I hope you guys have enjoyed being around with me and everything. So that'll be going live. That'll have gone live by the time you're watching this video. It's cool, it's good fun. I genuinely also realized that I hadn't eaten any breakfast yet. I had coffee and now it's 12 o'clock. So I'm just gonna skip breakfast and go straight to lunch, which is annoying because cereal is like my favorite thing. What is on the lunch menu today? I hear you cry. Well, let me show you what we are eating today. For lunch, we're just taking it chill with this Wiltshire ham cured and crunchy extra mature cheddar crumb. Woo wee! Look at this bad boy. We are just gonna lob that in the oven. In the oven. Cook that puppy up. It's gonna take like 30 minutes. Hey Siri, set a timer for 30 minutes. I can't set the timer for a specific time. Should I set an alarm instead? You can, you're a liar. <laughs> Let's put whisper to it. What time shall I set your candor liar alarm? <laughs> hey Siri, stop. Hey Siri, set a timer for 30 minutes. 30 minutes starting now. We roll. Hey 
here is what we got in the post today. And I've been waiting for it for a long time so that I can do a, a, a good job of it. So we got some of this today. Now this is premium dry condition chain lubricant from Muckoff. It's, it's chain lubricant, so I'm gonna give the bike a proper good clean. I've got some other stuff Woo around here. Let me show you what I've got going on. I've got this stuff here. Let me show you. This is the Markoff drivetrain cleaner. So we're gonna give the bike a real good wash. Then we're gonna use there, so we know. Then we're gonna use the lubricant on the chain to give a nice grease job, nice lubricated job. Then we are going to go for a cycle ride again this afternoon, because the weather is super nice, and I have been informed that next week the weather could take a turn for the worst. So cycle today, just get the most out of the good weather outdoors. It's really funny, right now in my kitchen, this happens every day. My, my kitchen is, is, is covered by the house next door. So from like now until the sun actually starts to hit this window here, my kitchen is actually bare cold, like actually freezing. Yesterday I put the heating on, it was a bad idea. Today I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna brave it out. All right, I'm just gonna leave the heating off. Look. Heating's over, okay, that's just a clock. Come on. It's not even gonna show me anything. Come on, there we go, there it is. Currently, we're set to 18 degrees. It's 19 and a half degrees in here. I tell you, it does not feel like 19 and a half degrees in here. guessing my way through cleaning that bike entirely. I think it's turned out all right. It looks shiny, it's been well lubricated. We'll see how it rides. We're gonna head out very shortly. I'm gonna get dressed, get everything, get everything kitted up and uh, head out for a ride. Go and enjoy the weather because it is gorgeous. And actually, it's, so, it's still outside as well. Like there is very, very little wind at all. So I think it's gonna be beautiful out here. We will be heading out momentarily. It's gonna be great. There it is, look. Clean. I think. I mean, you probably can't see much.
jokes. I've just found myself two pound eighty. If that ice cream van comes down here, I'm scoring myself an ice cream. I really hope it comes right now. I heard, I heard the noise. <laughs> I heard the noise, <laughs> but I don't see it yet. I don't know where it is. Post cycle ice cream, and that'd be so dope. It's pretty breezy out here anyway. It's a little bit windy. So I think I'll get inside, got a shower, get some dinner. Well, this dinner is fully but at least it looks way more glamorous than it actually is because it's just fish cakes and vegetables but needs eating, it's in the fridge it's good for me, fish, veg you can't really beat it can you so here's a question for you all does anybody just snack on cereal? or is that just me? Like I had a full meal, a full, I had a full meal, and now I'm on my second bowl of Cheerios. Just me? Just, just, just me, or, or anybody else? Yo, so I've been trying to work out what to do with my evening because it's eight o'clock-ish and I want to do something practical. I want to do something productive, but I don't know what to do. I've been, I've been thinking about it and I was like, oh man, what do I do? What do I do? So I think, I don't even know. I, gen I genuinely don't know. So I might just go upstairs and sit at the computer and listen to some music and see if anything, see if I can, I don't know, see if I get inspired. Because music tends to inspire me, so I'm gonna, uh, we're gonna pop upstairs just for a little bit and just see what happens. I'm gonna grab my laptop, I'm gonna grab everything. I'm just gonna run upstairs. I might. You know what, I'm gonna put the kettle on as well. Cause I could do with a brie. I could do with a brie. Get the man a brie. So I didn't actually end up doing anything to do with music. I'm actually just doing some research on classic mini stuff. Well, I've been watching a few videos about everything. About uh, what have I been researching? Basically, uh, electronic fuel management. There's so many different companies that provide an electronic fuel management system or an electronic ignition system for classic minis or for classic cars. And I'm trying to work out if it's something worth doing on my car, my Mini. The most annoying thing about it all is that 
at the moment my car doesn't even run so it's not even like I've got something that works that I can just like add things onto at the moment the mini doesn't have a full wiring harness in it so at the moment if I turn a key nothing happens I've got I've got all of the bits for it I've got a new wiring harness I pulled the old one out because it was crusty and it was disgusting and I wanted to get a new one do it myself be able to kind of have it how I wanted it however it was proving a whole lot more difficult to actually do that so at the moment I've got the harness downstairs just sat around I've been working on it trying to make sure that I've got all the right connections so that everything's working properly I tell you though it's not easy it's not easy in a classic mini you don't expect there to be a lot going on but I tell you I tell you this there's a lot going on in those cars that you don't expect there are wires everywhere so I'm just trying to work it out really the most annoying thing is that there's tons of diagrams that I've been drawn up for all of the new electronic stuff. So you can plug and play super, super easy with all the new stuff. However, when it comes to the old, old harnesses, there's so many variations, there's so many different connections. Not only on the wiring harness are there so many different like, versions and variations, but the car itself in the classic mini, you know, there's like 50 years of different like iterations and alterations of the, of the same car it's, it's been the same car it's just had a different engine in it or it's had slightly different things put in it you know and so it's so confusing so confusing and i'm just trying to make sense of it all so i've been watching a ton of videos so if anybody watches these videos watches me struggling my way through this and is like you know what i could help this kid out Please, please, help me. <laughs> help me. I would be so grateful. In any way, just message me if you've got if you've got ideas, if you think you know what's going on, or anything. Send me an email. I don't even care. And then after all of this happens, we can get back into the garage and do some good work get this mini finished i'm i'm so i'm so motivated to get this thing done it just is proving to be much more challenging and i'm you know like i said i love learning i love learning tons of stuff i love learning all the new things i just need help so please if you know anything about classic cars or about minis or about anything shoot me a message i would love i would love to hear from you well i've actually just educated myself very very well which is cool i've learned a few bits about the mini i ordered a couple of little parts just to make us work because man i want to get that thing done so that's really exciting actually getting getting to see some of that stuff and feel like, oh, okay, I'm actually going to make some progress with this. I've uh, still got a few more bits that I'm going to need to get for it. But man, you know, this stuff just stuff takes time. So I'm okay with that. I'm okay with it taking a little bit longer and just having to wait for stuff. That's all right. I'm going to pop the kettle on. Make a, make a brew. Make a brew, like I said earlier. I didn't actually make one. Uh, and I'm going to play some Xbox with the boys. Well, the time right now is 11.36 and I'm going to bed. I hope you have enjoyed your day. I hope you've enjoyed my day. Thanks for being here. Thanks for watching. If you're still here, you're a legend. And uh, I hope you have uh, an incredible rest of whatever it is that you're doing whenever you're watching this. Thank you for being here. Thank you for your support. And... Uh, see you in the next one which may be tomorrow i don't know but hey i uh, love you guys peace out